Hello Virgo, thank you so much for joining me. I'm going to be doing a reading for, for you today. It's going to be something that you don't expect, but it would benefit you to expect it. All right, what do we have for Virgo? Happy birthday. Happy Virgo season. What do we have for Virgo? So we may have Virgo children. Okay, we have six of swords. Virgo cusp, or you're dealing with someone who is a Virgo cusp. You have judgment. Someone could have a lot of Virgo a lot and a lot of Sagittarius energy. Okay. Show me what we have for Virgo, please. someone not wanting to move on or move forward. We have Pisces, we have Taurus. There's something about two going on here. Yeah, there's something. There could be some type of mirroring going on with you and another person. There's something about two. Two people. Someone is reflecting the other, or there's something about yin and yang, okay? There could be something about someone's perfect match. Damn, some of you guys are like, um, spiritually married with someone or, or very spiritually connected with someone here. You have a strong energetic connection with another person. That's what I'm getting so far. Um, there could be something about someone needing to leave a karmic situation or they're being forced out of a karmic situation. Someone could have been reluctant or struggling with this. Um, here, this could be a Gemini. Okay. Someone's like, Someone isn't aware of like the call that they're getting, but they're getting a call to move towards you or to move away from a karmic energy. Someone is being like compelled to make some sort of move, make some sort of decision. Um, I'm hearing create a reality for themselves. Uh, that's just something specific for someone. Some, someone is Canadian. <laughs> okay. Someone could be moving to Canada. I, okay, I'm, you know, this reading is not going to be for everyone. Okay, I just want to say that first. Second, someone is spiritually married with someone and they are going to be physically married to this person. You're getting married to this person again this reading is not for everyone you're marrying this person you're already married spiritually you are to be wed with this person um, someone wants to show off for you or when you when you're connecting with this person in the physical, they're wanting to like 
dress themselves up or you're dressing yourself up someone is being called to propose to but you guys are already spiritually married okay um when you get married there's there's some you're given the keys to something okay this could be very metaphorical this could be literal you're given the keys to something both of you have a key There could be a lot of abundance um, when it comes to marriage with this person. Either you or this person could have Jupiter in their seventh house. Which you just become more luckier in um, your healthy partnerships, in commitments to your partnerships. You become more and more lucky, more and more abundant, more and more blessed by Jupiter. Someone's getting married though. That's, this is strong. This is strong. But I am getting that this is like, so everything is happening spiritually first as it, as it does. There's something karmic that someone's needing to leave behind. It could be a karmic relationship. It could be a karmic job. It could be a karmic environment, place, house, family members. It's being done though. It's the first card here. It's the first card here. Someone is leaving behind chaos and karma. Someone is blessed for the decision they make, okay? Someone someone is being guided to propose someone's being guided to take the first step here there's something that you and this person are destined to receive but again it happens once you are married again this reading is not for everyone okay uh show me more for virgo the sun someone's gonna have a child or has a child there's a lot of major arcana here a lesson that someone learns right before you connect with them in the physical there's some type of realization or lesson or someone is being called away from their karmic energies and situations I'm also getting something about someone losing their job, but this is like the biggest blessing anyone could have received because of what happens next or because of what they're led to. Someone is choosing a divine connection. Someone is choosing a divine soulmates. There could be a lot of po positive karma coming out of that. Someone's forward thinking, future thinking. Someone is daydreaming about the future. Okay. Um, 
What else can you tell me about the situation for Virgo? What else can you tell me about the situation for Virgo? Um, someone is daydreaming about the future. They're keeping it to themselves or they're, you know, I don't know. I'm getting someone is like on the verge of proposing. This is the type of energy I'm getting. Someone is like to themselves daydreaming about the future. Okay. They want to take some sort of step. Okay. Um, there's a lot of love that I'm hearing. I want to say again, this reading isn't for everyone. Um, and this is a strong message attached to some type of marriage, specifically marriage, specifically two people, whether it's like a legal marriage or not. Like there's, there's a strong connection between two people. They are married spiritually, whether they're whether you're married to this person or you're going to be married to this person physically i'm getting that that's how it's manifesting but um if i don't know like if you're not resonating at this point it's not your reading all right show me more about the situation please for virgo very motivated ace of pentacles someone is highly motivated to take a step with you this is you know this is the ring someone is someone you're getting married okay that's that's this reading you're getting married someone wants to get married to you someone wants to ask you to get married okay there's there's a there's traveling for the honeymoon. Someone is very attracted to you. Someone's feeling very action oriented, very um, motivated to do something. Okay, what what um, has happened to create this like eagerness to come together with Virgo? What has caused this eagerness? Somebody gets out of a karmic situation and goes right for you. Um, but, okay. Eight of Pentacles. This isn't all of a sudden, okay? This is something that's been worked towards Ten of Cups. Someone has been, like, working. Someone is determined to receive their blessings, their abundance. Someone they're in love with you or they want they want a really happy loving relationship with you someone is very very excited for the future someone is very very amped up motivated ready to go and it's because of work that they've been doing someone has been working extra i don't want to ruin the surprise but someone is being proposed to someone is getting married someone has been working overtime to pay for our ring Somebody dreams of, of their like happily ever after with you. And there is so much, there's some, you're getting the keys to something. The second that you are united with this person in like a spiritual way, like you're receiving, again, this is metaphorical keys or this is literal keys. You're being blessed with something here. Um happiness abundance love okay someone is very excited for the future they're daydreaming someone um might have been a little disappointed because they felt like they didn't have enough or they weren't making enough okay thank you very much for being here so much love to you if this resonated i hope it provided you with guidance and clarity on your situation and thank you again for being here. Bye.